Well, hello guys. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to the Big Fat Sidekick channel. I'm so pleased to be reading again for you today. Okay, okay. So I've had a very uh, busy, busy uh, few days. Uh, I've caught up uh, with all my readings. Uh, I just have to uh, put out a, a shout out to somebody uh, who has uh, purchased a, a reading. It's a repeat customer. That's what I know. Uh, but they haven't sent the question. So uh, time's up at midnight, I'm afraid. Otherwise, I'll have to uh, send, cancel the order for you, uh, refund you, and wait for you to get in touch because they have tried it a couple of times as well. So it is, uh, you know, I think uh, RD are the initials. Uh, they they use uh, the, the husband's account. That's all I'll say. Okay, so if you can get in touch with me, my darling, uh, and uh, yeah. So send in those questions to me and I'll have it sorted there and then. Amazing feedback. Amazing. Okay. Uh, I'm so, I'm so honoured that I get to, it's like magic really. When you get to see somebody else's life and you haven't even had a conversation with them. You know, that's how it feels uh, to me. Like I can just see exactly what's going on. Uh, and I have never met this person and I've never looked at them. I've never seen a picture. Uh, I've never had any contact with them. So, you know, it is uh, truly uh, wonderful to have that kind of uh, insight. Also, uh, big news, big news, big news. Okay, so uh, private readings uh, uh, on eBay will be shifting uh, sometime this week uh, onto my website, www dot bigfatpsychic.com it's not just up there right now they're working on it today it's the same principle and uh, uh you know private information uh for your finance details that you would have on uh, ebay so uh you don't need to worry about anything it's uh it is all encrypted for you uh, and i don't uh have a clue about storing information so <laughs> just get rid of everything no no data protection act in this house i'm afraid okay so uh yeah just to, to make you aware of that and i will be uh bringing it up um and yeah we're going to start doing some uh like teaching videos uh as well teaching not just how to be a uh, psychic or to be a reader or to use pendulums or you know uh Teach her to have the uh, tools and skills that you need uh, to navigate and, and try and have a peaceful, calm uh, uh, life, you know. So uh, there'll be uh, a few things uh, on there. Uh, I've already done one video. I think it's uh, how you can turn, you know, uh, your knowledge into uh, a skill uh, and show others and you know uh, progress you know out of nothing out of nothing uh, and then there's some other ones as well so you know they are going to be uh, very uh, different to the uh, readings that I do on YouTube which is uh, brilliant just absolutely uh, brilliant so as soon as it's up and running uh, I will let you know uh, but they're uh, working on it uh, they're a proper company as well. They're not a flabbernite. Um, so, you know, I'm, I've no doubt that they'll have it done by the end of today. Uh, and uh, uh, announcements will be uh, revealed. So, you know, uh, this is uh, your last few days to get uh, a reading uh, off eBay uh, before we switch over uh, to my uh, website. OK, so uh, lots of fun, lots of fun. OK, then, guys, uh, let's have a look. We're going to... Oh, where do we start? Uh, where do we start? I'm going to um, start with James Hall, okay? Uh, James Hall, so let's have a look then. Uh, James, James, James is the uh, director or whatever, uh, CEO, bloody whatever, uh, of Arkwell. Aren't you well? Arkwell. I tell you what, you should call it not doing well. Not doing well, that's what they, they should call it. Uh, well, so you've had the reports out. Uh, I just want to get, you know, uh, James's um, take on this, you know, how he feels uh, about it. So uh, how does uh, James feel right now uh, about uh, Archie Well? The well's running dry. I mean, there's just no end to the uh, bloody, you know, uh, take the piss uh, words for well is they, you know, not well. So he sees that, uh, you know, 
he sees this uh, quite positive, okay, which is strange. But I'm, I'm getting he feels uh, positive. He doesn't seem to be a guy that would kind of commit fraud or, you know, I don't know. Is James, uh, does James have his own motives? No. What motives does James have? Yeah, you see, you know, he's not getting called home yet. He's not getting called right home yet. Uh, he will. He will. I still stand this guy, you know. I still stand that this guy uh, will, uh, you know, uh, blow the lid at some point. You see, he's waiting there. He's waiting for Harry, you know. Uh, you've outdone yourself this time, Harry. That's what he's saying. You've outdone yourself. So, you know, his, his motives are waiting for news uh, to uh, arrive till elsewhere. So, you know, what does James, uh, how does James feel uh, about Megan? <gasps> Look at that. I like this. I like this. I like this. It's going, it's all going well. It's all going well. Don't worry, uh, nobody, if, if Harry does see this, uh, you know, I think I must be on the radar scene, so it was that little fucker uh, that tried to ban me uh, that time. So, you know, uh, but the information, all the actions have already been done. It's not what is, you know, they haven't just started to do things wrong now. No, they've been doing things uh, wrong for a very, very long time. And what does he think of her? I think she's dis. <laughs> disgusting i was going to say uh disruptive uh she's nasty she's bad tempered she wants things all her own way you know uh typical uh narcissistic behaviors uh wanting to be in control but even when she's in control uh she manages to f everything up it's her way or the highway what does james uh you know how does James see uh, Harry's involvement? Greedy, just as greedy as her now, you know, greedy, greedy. You can't give this. No, we're not giving that much. No, uh, never mind, uh, you know, five grand. We'll, we'll give him 500, you know. So uh, this is also misusing uh, funds as well. Oh, dear, Harry. Oh, dear. Which brings me to another question, you know, is Harry and Megan, are they uh, the donators? <gasps> oh, they'll get into trouble for this. They'll get into trouble for this, okay? Yes, they are. Yes, they are donating uh, to themselves. They're their own worst enemy. So, uh, you know, on Megan's part, it would be, why would she pay money from, M, you know, from Harry's money uh, into the account? Because it's how it looks. It's how it looks. She doesn't want to look bad, you know. Uh, that's why she's doing it. That's uh, the, the reason uh, for her. It's just a, a complete and utter... like fraudulent setup and you can have as many companies as you like in bloody delaware you know as many as you you like but uh they, these donations have come from in big sums like a million uh it, from one account so what we're saying then uh they only had uh you know uh two people <laughs> that donated harry and Megan, they haven't got anybody else involved. Do you know why they won't have anybody else involved in actual? Because A, I think it's just a, a front and a, you know, a, a way that they thought they could uh, rake in money. But also, when you uh, start getting big donors in, uh, they want to know uh, where the money's going. They want to ask questions. They want to have a say, you know. Uh, what are we getting for this one million donation if you're not going to uh, tell us who it was or let us sponsor you? Uh, so, you know, 
I think this is uh, James Hull, you know, the magic here. I still get that he is, uh, you know, uh, still tied to uh, the royal family. How does James feel about the royal family? Overwhelmed, overwhelmed. So, you know, he's probably taking one for the team here. Uh, but he also, as well, you know, he, he loves the royal family. It's sort of like hurting him uh, that he thinks, you know, things won't get better uh, and that he can't move on quickly uh, enough, OK? Uh, he's, uh, yeah, he's, uh, you know, he thinks it's outrageous about what's been done. So the fact that he has sympathy for the royal still and none for these bozos, uh, tells me we're still on the right path, guys. We're still on the right path. Is James uh, aware of any potential uh, fraud going on? So he's blocked uh, fr from that, okay? Uh, it's uh, how, how do I mean he's blocked, right? So he can't get can't get involved you know he can't be involved in it okay he can know it but he can't partake he can suspect it uh but he can't partake so uh, i'm getting here uh, you know uh anxiety he's got a lot of uh anxiety uh, uh around this whether it can be pulled off you know is his name too close to mention i say james you know What does uh, James Hall say? What does... Yeah, come on then. So I want to know, really, if there's a link uh, between... Because he obviously can't take any action uh, that that would, uh, you know, bring him into disrepute uh, and he can't break uh, the law. So it's up to the minions uh, underneath, OK? So Harry and Meghan underneath uh, putting, you know... Uh, say they put money into a uh, a offshore uh, bloody Delaware uh, account, and then that account, you know, comes in as a donor, uh, and so it's like bypassing everything. Has to bypass uh, James. He can't be uh, involved at all. What does uh, James want to expose uh, about Megan? How she can't be trusted, you know. They're breaking the law. Megan's breaking the freaking law. You can't trust it. It's a hierophant reversed, you know. This is like a, a big uh, cuckoo scam, you know. Uh, all these uh, Del Delaware uh, companies, everything, uh, you know, hidden and tucked away. Now, they did say they had some money uh, well stashed, did Megan and Harry, in a, a statement to TMZ, I believe. Well, why ain't it in the freaking account then? Eh? Why isn't it in the bloody uh, accounts? Why can't we see it on the uh, tax return? This could be, uh, you know, an actual uh, investigation here. It's big, it's serious, it's wrong. Hidden discussions, you know, meetings about meetings and... This is why they're only doing uh, an hour a week because they're too busy, you know, uh, trying to uh, scam. I mean, the, the Megan's so close uh, to the edge on this, to, you know, so close. Uh, and I, I did feel before, you know, that she could be threatened uh, with, uh, you know, uh, legal action, serious legal action. So if you thought, oh, Megan, you know, so let's just say if Megan... Uh, got arrested and uh, was going to face uh, jail and it looked like she was going to face jail, do you think she would go to jail or do you think she would uh, take another way out, you know, uh, and die as a, a victim? What does, uh, you know, what does he want, what does James want to expose about Harry? Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, don't don't tell me he isn't uh, in, involved in these communications and stuff. So there's lots of uh, uh, paperwork and paperwork and more paperwork and more paperwork uh, for all these bloody uh, co you know companies. It's very hard uh, to to keep on top of. Will the IRS, uh, you know, uh, investigate Archwell? No. Not as yet. Not as yet. What's uh, you know, what's James's uh, whole? What's his uh, actions? You know, his future actions going to be uh, regarding Archwell. Well, I've, I see that he wants to get out uh, straight away, but, you know, at, at the end of the day, I think he's there for a reason, you know. He's there for a reason. Why is James Holt, uh, you know, there for a reason? What is the reason that James is there for? Because it's like I've got no choice. I've got to continue, you know. I've got to stay as I am just for a while. What is, uh, you know, James's true reason for being with Archwell I told you I told you for the Queen for the Queen okay for the bloody Queen because she asked him keep Harry out of trouble keep Harry out of trouble Why did the Queen want James to go with Harry and Meghan? Because, uh, you know, there's that many holes in her bloody story. Uh, you know, uh, she could sink uh, Harry. She could sink Harry, that's right. She could sink Harry. Uh, so it's there uh, for him to uh, so like steer him in the right direction, you know. Uh, keep keep uh, the waters calm. Keep uh, Meghan uh, from... You know, uh, sending everything into like a two tsunami or two tsunami. Is that... <laughs> I can't say that, I don't think, again. Anyway, uh, yeah, so, um, yeah, you know, leave, go with him, go with him. So he is not there for Harry or Meghan. He is there uh, because of the Queen. Uh, I've told you before, I still think he's involved with um, Prince William, you know, uh, as such. You know, what, what? What is James Holt's in involvement with uh, Prince William? He loves him. He loves him. He, you know, they're, they're winning their battle, they're winning the war on public, uh, you know, uh, recognition. Uh, absolutely, they are. So, you know, James, I'm telling you, is there. Uh, for for exactly the same reason that I said now and about what it does in the future with uh, I did a reading while I was in Egypt uh, regarding uh, James Holt he is the guy he is uh, the guy <clears throat> how does uh, James Holt feel about returning to the UK I love this I love this, you know. He'll come back uh, when him and William have decided, uh, you know, this is uh, William's card for uh, being the brother, the trustworthy uh, one, you know. James Holt wants back in the UK uh, for, for William. What are, uh, you know, uh, James's uh, future plans then for uh, Arch? Well... <gasps> I love this, I love this, tell the truth, you know, tr tell the truth about all the legal stuff, about all the uh, crap that's going on as well, you know. Oh, do you know what, I just have to say, like, so, uh, I see scales, you know, uh, weigh weighing stuff out, that might be drugs though, you know, uh, I kind of feel like uh, drugs there. Um, 
You know, in the olden days where they used to have a, a sick hole there, do you remember? I mean, I've only seen it on films, I think, but, you know, they used to have like a... You used to put a cigarette in it and it was... Uh, long and it was like fanciful i kind of feel like that even though it is their their justice card you know uh he wants to tell uh, their truth and that's why he's had to hold back a little bit he's getting a bit anxious though you know as things come by but he has been absolutely uh spot on uh he can't he's not the one breaking their law uh and i suppose uh that that's a, a relief okay it's a relief uh you have to very carefully navigate uh, Archwell, Meghan and Harry, uh, you know, so that you're not breaking uh, any laws. So I, I think uh, this is a good thing. I think this is a good thing. Uh, he intends uh, to tell the truth. Okay. And what will happen to Meghan once, you know, the truth uh, of this sham is revealed i mean we know everything about their personal life even the children but what we don't know is what the frick does archwell do you know what is the production company what is the audio what have they done we don't know a lot and big donators they want to know, you know. Otherwise, you might as well just give it out of your wallet into their purse. Uh, you know, if you're not going to get a uh, no, like a uh, so like a uh, public recognition uh, for it. Uh, what was that question? Yeah. Okay. So once the truth's out, how will uh, how will this make Harry look? Ah. Oh. It'll be under pressure. It'll be under uh, pressure. Okay, under pressure. Uh, it, poor decisions, in it? Poor, you know, like he's been stupid and uh, he's made uh, poor, poor, poor decisions. This is, you know, you can break uh, the law with this card. Uh, you, you know, it's like uh, obviously getting too greedy for your own good. You should have just stayed how you was uh, right at the beginning. But things have been changing. They're desperate for money. You know, uh, they feel comfortable as well by pushing and pushing the boundaries uh, of uh, this system. And how will Megan look uh, when the truth comes out? Like all she wanted to do was spend money on clubs and party party as long as their friends was okay. You know, uh, uh, buying friends, trying to buy friends, uh, you know. Uh, the the three of cups is like a, a nice afternoon out or a, a night out, you know, where you have fun and you catch up and everything. But it's only that. It's only a few hours. It's a few hours. Megan's going to look real bad uh, because it's not just her involved as well. She's got two of her friends involved. <laughs> Wonder who they could be. Wonder who they could be. I'll tell you what, though. I don't think they are who we uh, think it. Nobody like Oprah or Tyler should be stupid enough to uh, buy into this. Well, let's ask. You know, is Tyler involved in this? Oh, my God! <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. He was doing it for his own good. You've got films in as well in there. He's put money into the filming part. And what about Oprah? Is she involved? Now, she had too much on, you know, uh, too much on, so she's not involved. But Tyler is. Tyler, Tyler, Tyler's money is. How does Tyler feel about Archwell and uh, Megan and the money? Oh, you know, our progress is coming along. They're doing stuff. They're working together. They definitely are working uh, on something uh, together. Uh, so he's involved uh, as well. How would the truth uh, uh, about Archwell when it comes out affect uh, Tyler? How will that make uh, Tyler look? Weak, a coward, thick. 
lacks uh, ability, no credibility at all. No credibility, you know. Uh, it's like, so he, he's not the uh, forefront runner at all, but he is. He's part of it. He's part of it, okay? He is part of it, that's all I'll say. He might not be the crook in this situation, but what a stupid, 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 silly, silly, silly man. Yeah, that's right, Zala. You will regret this. You will wish you had never, ever got involved at all. Yeah, Tyler's not going to be happy uh, with this. So it seems, you know, uh, Meghan and Harry seem to be, uh, you know, uh, doing a lot of shady things, uh, a lot of shady things. And I go back again and say uh, it is James Holt uh, that one will, will uh, blow uh, the lid on this. He works for the Queen, OK? So when he went, he worked for the Queen. And it's still the Queen's wishes till he's done the job. Till he's done uh, the job. He was supposed to, you know, try and keep uh, Harry out of uh, trouble. Hmm. Well, we didn't know Harry is the Harry who he is now, you know. So they both deserve it, you greedy shit. Uh, and as for you, yeah, you are uh, destructive. You think you know it all uh, and you really, really don't. They're not about detail. They're about... The big picture. So I told you, uh, you know, Megan would spend a lot of time if she was having a dinner party. She would spend a lot of time uh, setting the table, getting dressed up, uh, calling all her friends, getting the invitations in. You know, uh, menu planners, this, that, and the other. Uh, table uh, cards. Yeah, and then she forgets to buy the food. That's that's what she's like. That's a metaphor uh, for what she is uh, like. Okay, so okay, guys, uh, brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Not going to ask the time uh, uh, of things because my time is always shit. <laughs> anyway, guys, it's been uh, amazing to do this reading for you, and I'll be back soon with another reading. Bye now. Bye bye. <laughs>